In dentistry, there's lots of different modules. There's the human health and disease module, which is uh, largely medicine, where we learn a lot about the uh, body systems. We have the oral cavity module, which is more specifically uh, tailored to dentists, because that's where we like to specialise on. It's got a lot of history behind it. Uh, we have our own dental hospital here. On the first floor, there's your general patients, then you have a whole floor dedicated to children's dentistry. We have a new lab which is full of phantom heads, which have all got their own computer screen as well, so that the lecturer can put up what you've been learning and then you try it on the head in front of you with a full set of teeth. From the first year, we have uh, early clinical exposure where we're shown around the clinic and we're familiarised with the uh, clinical environment. From the second year, we begin seeing patients practising simple tasks such as a basic examination as well as some scaling and polishing. As part of our course we do some work in the prosthetics lab, things like dentures and bridges, learning how to take impressions and then cast them up in plaster cast and stone and things like that until you're confident enough to have your own patient that you can make a denture for. As we get older and become more clinically competent, the patients we do take on are a lot more, the cases are a lot more complicated dentally. Crown and bridge work, changing people's smiles, it, gets, it all gets a lot more technical. I think in most respects a lot more enjoyable. In our third year we're sent to Barkentine, which is in the Isle of Dogs, which is a brand new primary care trust uh, facility. It provides a dental service amongst other things. It's fantastic, state of the art, it has digital x-rays on every bay. The team, they're brilliant. You really do feel more like a, a dentist rather than a student. As soon as you go in there, you meet the receptionist who gives you your patients for the day. And the staff there treat you as a colleague, as a fellow professional. We have a form of continuous assessment, which basically means that we're assessed throughout the course rather than um, in a huge exam at the end. So we can gain about 50% of the marks with our continuous assessment throughout the year, which is very good because it eases the pressure on us for our final exams. And because dentistry is practical, it's more I guess multidisciplinary, so you can kind of come to the exam, the written exam, but already have gained a lot of your marks through the assessments which are carried out throughout the year. I think this is great because it's a good mix of both, a wholly competent dental student. It was a really good choice because it's actually one of the best dental schools in the country. So we've got the best training, it's the best people, best academic staff, the best curriculum. So we've been given the best footing for our future careers. It's just worked out really well.